Hello everyone, this is Anton Dinaj from PocketNow.com. Windows Phone Mango brings a lot of features, 500 plus according to Steve Ballmer. And many of you have tried and succeeded in installing Windows Phone Mango Beta 1 or Beta 2, and then even the RTM release to manufacturing build on top of it once it was leaked. Now, Windows Phone Mango should be out anytime now, and the uh, rollout process should hit your devices really, really, really soon. But upon one condition, you have to be on the official track, which means your device has to run Windows Phone Nodo or the security update after Nodo, which is build 7392. In this video, we're going to show you how to revert from Mango to Nodo and wait for the official Mango update to hit your device. So stay tuned. Now, if you go into Zune, go to Phone, Settings, Update, you check for an update and it returns the following message. Your phone is up to date, version 7.10.77.20. Now, if this is something which you are seeing on your computer, don't panic. Just close Zune. There are really two ways of reverting to Noto. The first one is the easiest method. Remember that backup we told you to keep in a safe place, well that's the backup the tool used to install Windows Phone Mango created off your phone and um, it was here on your C drive in the uh, pre-Mango state folder. Now the tools which you have used required you to run the update.bat. Now reverting to Nodo is very easy, you just run restore.bat and the restoration process is going to be a one-click process. Now the second way of, of reverting to Nodo, and this is going to be the one which we emphasize on, requires you to take the uh, Nodo update of your phone, put it in the uh, Windows Phone Update folder and you will be restoring via Zune. So, um, you go to your C drive, to your pre-Mango state folder where your uh, backup is um, residing. You just copy the Noto backup folder and you'll paste it in the following folder. You go to your C drive, go to your users folder, your username, in my case it's Anton Dinaj. You go to app data, you go to local and scroll all the way to uh, Microsoft and Windows Phone Update. It should be clean, but if it's not clean, just paste it here and uh, in case you need to overwrite anything, overwrite, but make sure you keep a copy of what you are overwriting upon. Okay, so we have the um, update copied to the folder. We'll just launch Zoom. Wait a second for it to um, connect to the phone. There you go. Go to phone. Once again, go to settings and go to update. And beside that message, you should have available a restore option. And as you can see, our available restore point is of July the 2nd. Now, in order to restore, you'll have to click this restore button right here, which we're going to do right now. So let's hit it. Restore to previous version and you read and understood the above and you're ready to restore your phone. Next. And the restoration process is on its way. Phone is shutting down. It says goodbye. Hope to see you again, Mango. Really soon. And the phone should be restarting in its update mode. Let's see. Yes, it's in the update mode. I'll just place it here in the middle of the screen so you can uh, see it. There are a total of five steps. Now we are step number three, the restoration process. As you can see, a driver has been installed. And we have our status progress indicator on the top. We'll cut back in, in a couple of minutes. So five minutes later and we are still kicking as we 
approach the 50% mark right about now and uh, we'll cut back once again at the end of the process. So here we are 10 or so minutes after we started the restoration process and we are already at 99% finishing the process right about now and uh, we'll see what's coming up next. It stays a little bit longer on the 99% mark. And we're done. It's restarting the phone. Step 4 out of 5. Let's see that. Yeah, right there. It's restarting. Old Windows Phone logo, the circle, the round one. Mango introduces the new one. And we have an error of not enough space, but uh, this, I think, is in relation to the media which we are trying to sync to the phone. The phone seems to be stable. And restoration successful, we have to finish. And let's just confirm we had the uh, proper build. We go to settings we go to about and as you can see we have build 7392 which was the build we had before updating to Mango Beta it's the security update for Nodo patching Internet Explorer so you've watched how to revert to Nodo from Mango this was Anton Dinaj from PocketNow.com stay on the official track thank you very much for watching and if you like this video, give us a thumbs up.